This is me on the exact day that I started my hourglass and slimmer waist journey. I spent my whole life with t-shirts rolling up around the belly and looking very square in my dresses. I also didn't think an hourglass figure was possible for me at all because genetically most of the women in my family didn't have that either. After struggling for so many years, I finally found the perfect workouts and routine for me, which is what I'm going to share with you today. Hello daily student family, welcome back to another video. I hope you're all doing well. I hope you're all doing good and if you're new here, hello my name's Kimberly and I hope you subscribe. Turn your bell notifications on so you get notified every single time that I upload and give this video a massive thumbs up. As you guys can tell from the title of today's video, I'm going to be talking about how I got an hourglass figure because I know before this was something that I really struggled with for a long time. I've always had more of a round stomach, a square stomach and as you guys know on this channel I talk about what has worked for me in the past, in the present and in the future to share with you guys things that I have tested, reviewed and tried to share with you guys so it motivates you and shows you that on your journey you can come from looking maybe somewhere where I started to help you guys get along to where you need to be. I'm going to be sharing with you guys the workouts that I finally and officially found that really really helped me. As I say it took me over four years to be even able to get my crop top belly, hourglass belly and dresses, summer dresses is all sorts it took me a while so I'm so excited to be able to share with you guys my experience on what really really worked for the first time in over four years I'm going to share with you guys a bit of a disclaimer when it comes to working out your waist which really helped me there are different types of stomach exercises that are gonna help and some that aren't gonna help they're gonna keep you not achieving results not seeing anything and for me I found that exercises that solely focused on the outer muscles made me look so square and believe it or not there are a lot of hourglass and stomach workouts here on YouTube that solely focus on the outer muscles. These did not work for me. You know, I used to come home and do 200 crunches every single day and nothing would happen apart from me getting more and more square and it is scientifically proven that crunches are not actually the best contributor to an hourglass figure and to get abs at all. They're way, 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 way down on the list of the priority movements and exercises that you should be doing at all if you want to get any closer to getting an ab workout and that's what I had in my experience. I was just getting too square with crunches but luckily I have found the workouts that really transformed that. And it was only in studying a lot of fitness and nutrition and all sorts is where I found out how focusing on exercises and specific movements that give a deepest isolation into the stomach muscular will allow to achieve more of that hourglass look. For example, female bodybuilders have beautiful bodies but they tend to have more of a square stomach, a square physique. And the reason for this is that they do tend to do a lot of exercises that focus on the outer muscle. So because this is not what I wanted to do, I made it upon myself to really dig into the ones that focus on the deeper stomach muscular and isolation in those areas within the middle stomach. And I'm going to go be going through that with you today. As you guys know, this is just my journey, my experience, but hopefully it gives you some tips and ideas what could help you in your journey. Now guys, don't forget to follow my inspirational fitness page on Instagram as well as my podcast page as well. Now guys, this workout is fantastic. I think it sits on about 60 million views. So instantaneously, when I saw it when I was looking for stomach workouts, I was like, okay, this is clearly coming up for me a lot on YouTube. It's recommending it to me. Let's see how helpful this really is for me. And I love this workout so, so much. Really isolate the fact that movements like this are fantastic. I really felt the burn. And you have to remember that for me, I was coming from a long, long way away so just to put it into perspective so you guys can have an idea of how much this really burnt for me within just a week of doing this workout I really really felt a burn I really really felt changes and I love the idea that when I laugh I can feel my stomach muscles working so hard every time I laugh or you know, make a movement and it's workouts like this that really really allow me to feel that it burnt my results even followed after that so I love this for that reason it's hard it's easy it's a short video but also the person in this video is showing you their progress as they go along each day and I have documented my journey doing this workout of each day and how my body changed and it's phenomenal you more so see results if you compare day one to day seven and I'm I kid you not, this was so, so worth doing. And I believe that if you do this whilst eating healthy as well, it is the key to really seeing the benefits of the video because you don't want to be putting on the weight as you're working out. But this workout is phenomenal to take you to that next level. For me, 
it was drastically different to the ones I was doing before. Like I say, a lot of the very, very popular stomach workout hourglass videos gave me a very, very square physique and no results. Whereas this one was completely transformative for the very first time before and I loved it for that reason. And I would also mix this in with walking every day. Like I say, balance it out with mixing it in with some low intensity then I would walk as well. That's what worked for me. That's what I found was completely different and transformative to the end journey. Mixing in, when I mixed in high intensity, then I mixed in low intensity, then I would walk 30, 20 minutes a day, you know, just that little bit because I wanted it to be sustainable and that was the key for my transformative journey. The next workout is none other than Pamela. When I first tried Pamela's video, I was sweating. And then when it comes to this ab video, I kid you not, it was game over for me. Game over in this sense that it burnt me like crazy and I was feeling everything seeing results so so quickly again her combinations of movements are ones that even with my crossfit background with my training background I know are so so key and crucial for that deeper stomach isolation and muscular isolation and I love this video for exactly that the movements that she incorporates in the sequence that she incorporates them in I found them to be fantastic they gave me such a burn they are results in again really really good but what i also like the movements that she adds like this they will burn it's the what for me i found it's the ones that look easy are the ones that are going to burn so so much and i isolated this movement again on days where i wanted a rest day or didn't want to do much working out even isolating this movement for me allow me to continue the progression of results which is why i feel like my results came so much faster than ever before is because i think oh i'm watching my favorite program in the break let me quickly do this isolated movement by Pamela. Three minutes, then I do another three minutes before I go to bed. And it's things like this that have really transformed my entire, entire results. Finally seeing an hourglass shape, finally seeing an hourglass figure than ever, ever before. The next video is Chloe Ting. Now, I have spoken about before how some of Chloe Ting workouts have made me look square. And it was only up until finding of this workout or workouts like th that she's done that featured this movement that changed it up for me completely with my experience with her workouts and I love this one because again I was a lot further into my journey by the time I had done this one and that's why I love it so much because by then your body gets stagnant your results stop you know in the first week your results are all there but then they kind of stop a little and it was this workout that I knew that I'm so deep into my journey but it was still burning it was still giving me results so quickly and so effectively that I loved it so much movements such as this are going to burn it's moments like this where I think Chloe, what are you doing to me? But it's so, so good for that reason. This workout as well offers the full rotation of not just the outside muscles, but a lot of the inside muscles at muscular and isolation as well, which is so, so important for me because I felt the inner, you know, when you start seeing the abs a lot in the inner sections, the inner areas, and you really feel it burning that particular part when you're working out. And, and, and that's why I love it for that reason. Again, I incorporated this with walking. So again, 20 minutes, half an hour every day. I did have a split of time where I did 15 minutes every single day and I kid you not my results were still so transformative so you know and, and and I really do believe movements and workouts like this are a huge catalyst for that now the next video and the last video is this one now I kid you not I've always said how much I love Amy Wong's videos for me I would say they're one of the most advanced in terms of a uh, routine sequence and a workouts when it comes to a full routine of hourglass figure thigh slimming anything like that and I love these workouts for that reason offers offered me a deeper muscular and um, a deeper isolation on the right uh, movements the right ones that are not just crunch level that aren't really progressive and it's actually known that crunches scientifically aren't the best way to achieve an hourglass to achieve abs because crunches and I used to come home every single day and do 200 crunches a day and see absolutely no results but it is known that they're not the most effective this workout is so good and it burns. I isolated movements such as this because they are so so good. I found them to be one of the most <laughs> burning workouts and movements that she has ever done and I've ever seen on her videos. It was a fantastic start for that reason and I love love this workout. Now guys as you guys know I always say make sure your food is there. Eat in moderation. Do your deficit because it's so important. In order to see results you also want to be eating healthy. You don't want to be pushing on the weight as you're working out and doing all your hard work. It is really really 
really important to stay in that deficit and to eat healthy to your own body style. Do remember that the results that I got were exclusive to me, but I love to share them with you guys to see if there are any tips and tricks that you can add for your own journey. Now, if you want to see um, a routine of this or for me to do a routine of this, do give me a thumbs up and I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye guys.